So several people have asked me about doing tours of various battlefields in, in, with their classrooms. And I've done some Skype calls and Google Hangouts from Gettysburg and Antietam into classrooms. But I thought one of the easy ways for you to be able to do it is through Google Maps and Google Street View. So here you can see I'm just in Google Maps. And first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to turn on the Earth version and we start to get the layout and I can start to zoom in but it's easier if I just type in like my favorite battlefield Gettysburg and I zoom in and there's the town of Gettysburg I'm gonna go ahead and close this little information bar over here so we can see more of the screen and I'm gonna scroll down and here we are on the portion of the battlefield that is the one the uh, down around the peach orchard here's devil's den little round top and I could click on any of these and bring up information but what I really want to do is a street view tour so I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna zoom in a little bit and I'm gonna grab my little guy here in the lower right hand corner and I'm gonna come over and I can put him on any one of these little locations right here so I'm gonna put him on right there and all of a sudden I'm on the top of um, the devil's den and I can see the various monuments here I am and I can go this way and so I can come down the street this is a witness tree right here at the top of devil's den uh, you can see the various uh, cannons and you can get different views there's little round top way out there in the background and if I continue down this road I can continue to tour and I can continue to look around at different things that are going on so I can just kind of take a view of wherever I want. So if I grab this guy again and I drag him, now I can see these little dots right here too. So let's take a look at this dot right over here. So I drop in. Now I'm in the Rose Farm and I'm looking around. And there's a very famous rock related to the, um, the photographs that were taken in this area. And some of the you that may have done the tours with me, I've stood next to that rock and showed it to you. This was a, where William Frasinito found... Uh, identified this rock and used it to identify the locations of uh, a lot of the dead that were buried a lot of the photographs of the dead soldiers were taken right here in this spot where this photograph was taken so that's the rock that the historian William Frasinito found and there were dead bodies along these rocks and up in this area and then there's one photograph uh, that shows there's a dark room up in here and I've done tours from this area uh, for people for classrooms but you can get a 360 degree view of the Rosewoods, and this is where a lot of the bat a lot of the uh, dead soldiers of the Battle of Gettysburg were taken. So if I go back out, uh, again I can look around anywhere I want to. I can come up here to Little Round Top. What's really cool too is I can look at some of the trails. So these is the this is the road leading up to Little Round Top. So I can look, you know, just follow the road up if I want to. I can follow the little trails. That'll take me right up to Little Round Top. So there I can see the, the monuments at the top of Little Round Top. I can look around. So I'm walking up this little trail and just looking around at different parts, parts of the battlefield. The other thing I can do is look at other battlefields. So I can go up here and I can type in Antietam. I can do the Antietam National Battlefield, the Visitor Center. And there's the Visitor Center right there. There's the Dunker Church. So again, I can grab my little guy. I can come down and pop him right on there. And now I have the view of the Antietam battlefield. And there's the Dunker Church. And I can look around different parts of the battlefield. There's the visitor center in the background. And the, again, the various monuments. So just a way for you to be able to do a virtual tour of various places, including uh, you know different battlefields, as Gettysburg and Antietam, and looking at different locations throughout history so it's a way if you can't take your kids to uh, on a virtual tour there's an easy way to be able to do it through Google Maps always fun sharing little tips and tricks if you have any ideas and thoughts shoot me an email and let me know thanks